Welcome back. 30 seconds later. Oh, okay. You can say your intro. Oh, I just said hello again. Oh. Uh, today we have Alan and Ginter. It's a retail box. I realized I after just... I purchased it that it's a retail box, not a hobby box. Yep, that one. I didn't know that this came in retail boxes when I bought it. So, yeah, but... This thing is thick. The left side feels thicker than the right side, so I'm going to start on the right side. Uh, I mean, it's telling me to look for autograph cards and relics, so I guess they exist in retail. Yeah, usually they'll exist, but it's a lot more hit or miss. With of an already hit or miss chance. <laughs> Isn't that so fun? So yeah, Allen and Ginter, uh, it's retro style cards, there's mini cards, uh, rip cards I know exist, they're pretty rare, though. Or no, that might be Gypsy Queen. But yeah, we're looking for retro style cards, they have really weird, goofy inserts, like club sandwiches, uh, I think there's bird cards called Talented. So that's, oh, so that's what we're dealing with here. Greg Maddox. Uh, oh yeah, and then of course there's cards of non-baseball players. Like Football Man here. Okay. Yeah, here's the mini cards. And here's the Talented, our first one. The Harrier. Oh, and a beeping thing. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, you guys excited for... The regular season starting for hockey and playoffs for baseball. So the regular season starts today. I thought it was tomorrow. Otani. Oh, nope. What is that? A marimba. So yeah, we've got musical instrument cards. And oh, please God, tell me there isn't a beeping thing in every freaking pack. Every pack, that seems a little excessive. Well, I opened two and there was a beeping thing in each, but it doesn't look like there's one in the third pack here. Yeah, like I remember back in the day when, like, I used to get, like, hockey fat packs and stuff like that, because that's what I thought was cool. Um, those would usually have one in them. I understood that, but. Jose Altuve spotless seams, spans. It's hard to read the font. Yeah, I rem I was watching some videos today of people opening like blaster boxes and, and thinking about how I used to think those were like so cool. Yeah, like, well, I, I still Can remember or us. Now, to be fair, they sometimes had some decent stuff in it but uh i remember we used to buy those little uh you know like five dollar packs or whatever okay well, i mean those guaranteed hits for 15 whatever who is this eh, some of the some of them did okay this is a TikTok star. So, so happy that he's getting cards. Wow. A green rookie. TikTok. Stupid. The Lascaux Cave in France. 
mini card. And talented great horned owl. Stephen Kwan, rookie. Tony Gwynn. Raphael Devers. And those are good names. Okay, those are man with a lobster. Casey Webb with a lobster. And parasailing. Fun in the sun. What did you say? Lobster, I was about to say, is it Mr. Tomato? Oh, of course, Lobster Fur. Yeah. That nobody watching this is going to get. I don't um, know. Mr. Tomato ever sees this. Okay, we got a black mini of Cabrera. Miggy. Uh, I don't know if blacks are rare or anything, but yeah. Torres, Brinkman, Rendon, Freddie Freeman, Dodger edition. So shitty edition. Oh, beeping thing. It's been a while since we pulled a beeping thing. Okay, that man's holding a football. Jordan Walker, rookie, mini, fun in the sun, snorkeling. Snorkeling? Yeah, and a peeping thing. My parents just went snorkeling like a week ago. They were in Hawaii. They told me that they were going to Hawaii like the day before they went to Hawaii. a lot during the year now? Uh, no. They they don't go a lot. That's an Allen Wrench mm. card. Why? <laughs> Talented. The Siriema. And a beeping thing. I guess they had a timeshare, though. So. They were using it. Oh, that's fair. That's fair. I think we're using the same time share when we go to New Orleans in December. That is Robert uh, De Niro. Yeah. This sounds like a really random set. Cedric Mullins, Garrett Cole, Adley Rushman, that's a good rookie card. He's probably going to win Rookie of the Year here, and it's a mini too. Uh, yeah, this set is definitely strange. I guess you'll have to, to watch the video to get the visuals. Yeah, but I'm just hearing like the description here, and that's pretty interesting as it is. Yeah. Don't you want a De Niro card when you're opening packs of baseball? I, I feel like he has to have been in like a baseball movie before. Uh, yeah, he was in The Fan with... Was he Snipes? Yeah, I was going to say, even, it could, even if he hadn't, I'm sure he's just a fan of baseball, too, so... Or no, that was... That was the other one. Who's the... Who am I thinking of? The other Italian actor. The, like, big the one. Other... Brandon Nimmo mini fell out. 
was it? I don't know, Al Pacino? Like, I don't know. That's who I, Okay, yeah, I do mix those up sometimes. Just because they're both Italian. But no, it was De Niro that was in the fan. Yeah, Wesley, he plays the fan. Uh, and Wesley Snipes is the star of the Giants. <clears throat> who uh, De Niro is obsessed with. And starts to stalk. <clears throat> and speaking of the Giants, we got a... See, this is a cool insert. This one makes sense. It's like, uh, it's like a place card, and it's, it's the stadium. Yeah, nah, those are like, I kind of like the ones that feature places as long as the artwork is done relatively well. And the stadium makes more sense than the one we got of like a cave in France. Yeah, the Lasko cave, that makes no sense. Yeah, this one I have... Uh, it looks like an MLB reporter. So, I mean, at least she's baseball-related. Nata Cheney, who are you? For her role as the voice of Atch Ketchum. Okay. A voice actress. That's even weirder. Then Olivia Pachardo, college baseball player. I mean, at least it's baseball. Hmm. So yeah, we got the voice of Ash Ketchum in our uh, in our baseball box. God, please give me literally like any relic or autograph box. Nolan Arenado, a Buster Posey mini. That's neat. This is why I'm upset that I didn't realize it was retail. Because you could have potentially been hitting better versions of these cars. Uh, beeping thing. And I know in hobby boxes you get uh, three hits that are autographs mm. or relics. And uh, some combination of those. Jet skiing. And you're down to our last couple packs here. Another beeping thing. DMC and paddleboarding. Like paddleboarding in the ocean? Yes. Okay. That's our fun in the sun card. Mm. Okay. Who are you? Captain Sandy Yawn. On Bravo TV's Below Deck Mediterranean. Oh. Mitchell. Benson. Basketball Man. And George Kirby. I mean, I see Ricky Henderson on the back. It would be great if that was autographed. Jonathan Valena, uh, fashion guy, Schwarber, I mean this looks like a parallel, Tory Hunter, it's got like a shiny border to it, so maybe that's something, it doesn't look like it's numbered. numbered stuff in retail? I don't know. If you'd like to know, maybe we can... person watching, maybe it'll show us the odds. Nope. For approximate odds, visit tops.com. Okay, I'm not doing that. I was gonna show them the pack. Muskie, Gonsolin, Old Time Hockey, what? 
<laughs> he is a YouTuber named Old Time Hockey. <clears throat> Just red Kite Talented. So yeah, people, uh, when you're buying cards or boxes, read the description of the box more carefully than I did. Always look for the golden word, hobby. The Pippa music in your to your ears instrument card. Uh, looks like two packs left. I mean, still, we got an Adley Rushman mini rookie, so that's pretty solid. If nothing else. I don't really know who that is, but I'll believe it. He, oh boy, this person is 150 years old. Is it like one of those old, like, painted style cards? The Silver Slugger, Benny Wasserman. Hmm. Impersonating Albert Einstein. Cast in, as Einstein in four movies. Hmm. Interesting. But yeah, uh, Angkor Wat. But yeah, uh, Adley Rushman is the star rookie catcher of the Orioles. He's probably going to win Rookie of the Year. In the AL. Aren't baseball rookies like 25? It, it depends. It like so They can be. It's not weird for them to like develop in the minors for a while. Yeah, I was going to say, like we had a dude in our high school class that got drafted. And every once in a while I see if he ever made it to like an actual MLB team and... He hasn't got there yet, but... And that about sums up the box. The last pack having Wander Franco, the pedophile. Oh, what a great way to end it. Great. Uh, yeah, that was our... I don't remember who in our high school was drafted. Uh, at this point, it's relatively inconsequential, but... Mm. But yeah, there's our uh, box of Allen and Ginter. We got the Tory Hunter thing that's bordered, like different. This, a San Francisco, the ballpark. Looks like McCovey Cove. Adley Rushman mini rookie. I, do, I don't know if this is rare, but it's so fucking weird that I think I love it. The Allen Wrench card. Uh, Stephen Kwan rookie. <laughs> And green. So, yeah. There's our box. Thanks for watching. Uh, I think I'm going to eventually get an actual hobby box of these and see what our three hits are. Yeah, a hobby box would be preferable for really anything. And this, this said, like... It's it's goofy, but I think it's fun. So I think if you're opening it knowing you're actually gonna get something, it would be a solid a solid time. Uh, exactly. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time when we open something. Yeah, say what? Well, what after that is? What? Whatever that is. Oh yeah. Uh, there's 40 more seconds till 20 minutes, so I'm just going to drive up our engagement time here by talking. Um. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Uh, let us know what you thought. Tell us we're hack frauds. All of that good stuff in the comments. See ya. Bye.